We're kind of uh, getting uh, Todd's mouth watering for ice cream. That's yeah. one yeah, of the I simple can't. pleasures he wants mm -hmm. for Father's Day. Had it last night. Um, what and I kind? Um, it was from Dairy Corner, Scarborough. Ooh. And I have the weirdest flavors. Like okay. I, I get the large and okay. I got three different flavors. One was Cherry's uh, ju Jubilee. Jubilee. Yeah. Another one was the uh, the peanut butter with oh, uh, that's peanut butter uh, cookie dough. Wow. And the third one was uh, chocolate explosion with brownie bites. <laughs> so a little bit of you everything smush in it there. All together? I, no, but I did like it just they all kind of end up melting yeah. together mm, and yeah. I don't care. I love it. Like wow. it just keep bringing Sugary it. Sugary goodness. Right? Love so it. anyway, um, <laughs> that's going to happen again at some point this weekend. <laughs> I guess. So we'll have um, the weather for well, it. Yeah. Early early happy Father's Day. Yes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you ladies. It's very nice of you. I'm very excited. Mm -hmm. All righty, let's get going. Friday, it's going to be a beautiful day. You can already tell. There's not a cloud out there, nice and clear, and not a ripple on the water either. You know, if you're out and about early this morning, maybe doing some striper fishing, they're hitting all the time right now. It's getting good. Um, it's nice and calm. Love this time of the day. Love this time of the morning because this afternoon there'll be a lot of ripples out there and it's going to get a little choppy with a south wind that kicks up. So if you're doing some boating, keep that in mind. Look at these temps. Pretty cool. Berlin, New Hampshire, Freiburg, Sanford, Lewiston. Uh, Callis and Rockland and Wiscasset all in the 40s right now. And you know what? Last hour in Coas County, it was in the 30s, like 36 might be the low for Berlin, New Hampshire. That's pretty cold. The air is very dry still. I do expect the humidity levels to kind of creep up this afternoon and a lot more tomorrow where you'll actually notice the humidity in the air tomorrow. But today it's still beautiful with high pressure over the northeast. Tomorrow this front approaches and we squeeze out a couple of showers and storms. Clear, real quiet out there. Those chilly spots are already starting to warm though as the sun's been out for about an hour and 45 minutes now. Statewide sunshine, no isolated showers for the crown of Maine today. You catch a break. So that means a beautiful day across the pine tree state and getting warm. Midday temps will approach 80. Then in the afternoon, the winds get gusty out of the south. That sea breeze will do a couple of things. First of all, it's going to cool the coastline off through the evening. It's also going to add a touch more humidity to the air, but not enough for any showers this evening. So outside plans are going to be phenomenal. You know, if you're doing a little fire pit or doing a little barbecue, hanging out on the back deck, any kind of thing like that. Low 80s for all of interior Maine today. Lewiston 81, Augusta 80, Waterville and Bangor 81 degrees. Warm spot Caribou and Freiburg at 83. And then there's your coastline. We still reach warm temperatures, mid to upper 70s, but by like 4, 5, 6, 7 o'clock in the evening, it's going to feel a lot chillier and you're going to probably want a sweatshirt at some point. Scattered showers and storms tomorrow, especially during the afternoon. Some may get briefly strong and then they're gone for Father's Day, mostly sunny. And the end of the weekend and early next week are actually looking pretty warm, looking at highs mostly in the mid 80s for a couple of days. Watching a system, tropical system, work to the east coast, interacting with a front. Looks like we're going to squeeze out some beneficial rain on Tuesday. I showed you this yesterday down in the Gulf of Mexico. Still hasn't formed, but there's a 90% chance that it does and could be called Claudette, bringing lots of rain to the Gulf Coast and hopefully for us too. Small chance for some severe storms tomorrow afternoon. Biggest concern within any that do pulse up would be some gusty wind, and we'll keep an eye on that radar for you. Here's the marine forecast. South winds 15 to 25 knots. It's a little breezy, a little breezy out there for the afternoon and wind in uh, seas three to four feet. So there's that chop. 80 degrees, mostly sunny. 70s tomorrow, higher humidity and some scattered thunderstorms. Sunday looks beautiful, mostly sunny, 80 to 85, mid 80s on Monday. And then we're looking at the potential for some tropical rain here Tuesday afternoon, Tuesday night and kind of want it. Yeah, I think everybody it. does yeah, at this point because sure. anytime you can get the remnants of a tropical system, so that wouldn't be wind and that wouldn't be coastal flooding, but it would have the rain yeah. this time of the year. You say thank you, Mother Nature. Yeah. May we have another for right. sure. You know? I believe for you referred sure. to that as decayed effects. Is yes, that right? yes. The decayed tropical system. Yes, you were listening. I, I listen to every word you say. Tom. <laughs> that's a, I, I, that's a mistake. <laughs> me, me Corey, too. That's a mistake. That's a mistake, Sam. <laughs> All, right, All right. Thank thanks. you, Todd. Sure.